hello guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl beauty guys a lot have been happening from one basketball to another and we are concentrating on this particular one that has turned the internet almost upside down which the online tribune and daddy freeze brought up yesterday that says popular nigeria celeb DNA result revealed that his son is not his own. Yes, that is what we are here to discuss. Guys, when the whole issue came up, we have been trying to do one or two research to know who this person is. And you know, we always have online in-laws, savage commenters. We have so many categories of people in the internet space some we are saying is it you le doshe is it you know but all finger kept pointing at judy austin and you le doshe but guys we don't know yet and then we were able to draw one or two lines to be able to come out with what we are giving to you today yes so it all started when the ex-husband to Judy Austin, uh, Obasi, yes, Mr. Obasi, said that the child they call Stadike, whom Yul Edoshe is saying is his child, might be his own child. And that he think a DNA result, a DNA test should be conducted. And you know, because of that particular statement, so many online in-laws, they were using brains like, tell uh, you Edoshe to go and have a test, to go and do DNA tests. They were dragging up and down. Yet, he didn't go for a DNA test. And another, why we are trying to know whom this popular Nigeria actor or celeb is, we run across a particular news that this lady whom you are seeing on the screen slumped and died in church sometime last year and the story was not pure. According to what I read online and what I saw online, this particular lady was the ex-girlfriend to you, Edoshe whom Judy Austin saw as threats that would be blocking or standing as a stumbling block to her way. But last, last, the guy by, yes, the guy by. And it did not just end there. You'll have been a youth who is full of life, who has political ambition, who has contested for an office before, but he did not and according to the research we made, when Judy Austin came into the picture, he saw that Yul was full of life, political ambition. She saw it's a big fish she should go for, a fish she should probably, probably hold on tight to. And then he sweet-talked Yul, letting him know how he needs to be fortified while preparing for his election. And according to what we saw on the internet, not me, not my report, what I read, you can still go and read it. It says, you followed um, Judy Austin to be fortified. And after they came back, you Edoshe never remained himself again. That was when he came out online, introduced Adike, introduced Judy Austin, and that was what better that name, Her Excellency Judy Austin, always called herself today. Her Excellency was as a result of youth political ambition, and that after you might have won the presidency or won the presidential election to become Nigeria's president. She will become Her Excellency. So, that was what we also saw. So, guys, 
If you notice, after this particular revelation was made by you, that he now had a new son born by the new wife, Judy Austin, all of a sudden, his political ambition died. The person who the youth were willing to do fundraising to raise the money for the farm was no longer there. The whole of Nigeria was angry with him. How he could bring out such revelation in such a crucial time while he was preparing for the primaries. And we all know how that story went. Now, if you go into the internet space and check properly, you will see that the Freeze Online Tribune, Sarah Martins, and so many other persons who have posted these particular DNA issues. And since the issues have been like this, some are saying it's you, Ledouche, Judy Austin, and all that. And some said, just after a year, a young, ambitious child, a talented and a brilliant child, who is full of life, just went like that. And some even drew the conclusion. They drew uh, an assertion an saying that Lynch Edoche, the brother to Yul Edoche, already made a revelation in a video I am going to drop right after now, saying that all evil have an expiring date. But evil has an expiring date. And some said, could this be the expiring date he was talking about? Some said, yes. If not, how come you deleted Star DK's picture and Judy Austin first? before wiping out all those the pictures, the stories, the video, even those brand he was an ambassador to. How can we wipe off everything? Remember, you he seen mourning his son, let Kambili Shuku, may his soul rest in peace. Guys, you have seen what we are trying to draw. The link between Lynch Edoche statements saying all evil have an expiring date, you deleting, camp, uh, deleting Star DK and Judy Austin's pictures from his timeline first, and then he proceeded to delete everything he has in his own page. He has never come online to make anything. No one in his family has come except the brother and the father. So we are yet to know what is really going on and what is happening tell us what you think about this particular um issue tell us what you think about it thank you for staying tuned thank you for watching to the end this is gossip with beauty in case if this is the first time you are seeing this channel please hit the like button subscribe and turn on the post notification so that whenever we drop this like this you will be notified and you will be the first to watch. It's as easy as that. Thank you. Tell us what you think in the comment section. We will see you again on our next video. Bye.